what's up? Welcome back to a short and sweet episode of What Would Jen Wear? This is a segment where you tweet me your fashion dilemma and I answer it. But before we get into that, I have some really exciting news to share with you. I styled and modeled a music festival lookbook with Shop Sosie. They flew me out to Palm Springs and I created some really warm and effortless outfits that would be perfect for Coachella. If you're interested in looking at the lookbook, head on over to shopsozy.com and let me know what you think about the images. With that said, let's get on straight to the tweets. The first tweet comes from Godston. I just got accepted to my dream school. What do you suggest for my first day of art school? Well, first off, congratulations on getting accepted to your dream school. That must feel absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna assume that there is no strict dress code because I'm gonna assume that it's a college. And so this is what I would wear on my first day to art school. I would say that this is very true to my style. It's bold, risky, and playful. I thought I'd jazz up an all white outfit by throwing on a baggy jean lapel jacket. I decked myself out in some statement accessories and then wore my galactics. And since it's an art school, your peers are probably going to be more in tune with the trends going on and they'd appreciate someone who isn't afraid to express themselves. I know I would if I was going to art school. Next up, I've got a tweet from Moko Nyan. I have plenty of snapbacks but never really know how to style them. Help! So snapbacks have been my absolute jam lately, especially when I'm pairing an outfit for a night out on the town. I chose to style my badass it snapback because this is the one I've been grabbing to the most. I think it's because it adds a hint of color to my otherwise neutral outfits. I wore a high neck polo top with some tattered boyfriend jeans from K-Style Me. And for the most part, adding a snapback isn't really a calculated decision for me. I just put it on whenever I feel like it. I think as long as it feels good, just throw it on. I just go with what feels right, so I suggest you do the same. Here's a tweet from a question for Jen. I've bought a pair of PJ pants recently, but I'm not sure on how to go about styling it. Any suggestions? Thanks. I'm a huge supporter of wearing PJ pants 24-7. Last year, I bought this pair of paisley printed PJ bottoms from Uniqlo with the intention of wearing it in for lounging and also for going out in. I spruced them up by adding a thick woven belt. By adding this, it cinches the waist and creates a put together outfit. I wore a basic gray top to neutralize the pattern and wore some tall strappy platforms. Give me a few inches. I've got a tweet from Kimberly. How would you spice up an outfit for spring? I love the spring colors, but I want to maintain an edgy or casual style. I think it's totally possible to have a casual and edgy spring outfit. One of my favorite spring and summer colors is a bright yellow, and so I styled an outfit around my almost neon yellow cardigan. I love pairing bright colors with neutrals, so I'm wearing a white open knit top and my tan denim cutoffs. It's edgy because I stacked on a lot of jewelry, and it's still casual since I'm wearing some gladiator style flats. So the last question comes from Lucky Number Alex, and she asks, what would your go-to outfit be for a shopping day slash chill day with friends? If I'm just having a low-key day with some homies and I just want to keep it casual, I go straight to my comfort zone and I'll wear a baggy graphic tee. I think it's easy to slip in out of if I'm trying out clothes in the dressing room. Because I don't want to look too sloppy, I added a beige trench coat and I think it also makes it a little bit more spring appropriate. And then I paired everything with my busted knees skinnies. If you can tell by now, I'm having a serious moment with distressed denim. So those were all the questions I chose for this round. If you'd like to be featured in the next episode, feel free to tweet me at I'm Jen M with your fashion dilemma. And don't forget to use the tag WWJW so I can find it. If you enjoyed this video and you want me to keep this segment, give this video a thumbs up and also open the description box for outfit links and for the lookbook info from Shop Sozi. I love you all and I'll see you later this week. Bye!